Hello everyone, Supermando Bros here, and today let's take a look at the Jack specific 5 inch Mario figure based off his new look from the Illumination movie called the Super Mario Bros movie, which is surprisingly the first time we've ever gotten a Mario movie, which is crazy to me. Taking a look at the packaging, it does look really nice. It reminds me definitely of SH Figure Art style packaging. On the front, we got the Super Mario Bros movie logo, a render of Mario, his name, the official Nintendo seal of approval, as well as Jack specific, and some warnings. On the side, we got an image of Mario, on the other side, we got an image of Mario with the Mario Movie logo. And on the back, we have an image of Mario. They let us know that there's 16 points of articulation, as well as premium details and realistic eyes. We'll get to that in the actual review. And on the top, we got the Mario Bros. Movie logo. And on the bottom, a whole bunch of legal stuff that they had to add in. Overall, it is a nice package. It's simple, gets straight to the point, and there's some nice detail throughout the entire package. But I do think it's a bit too big for the actual Mario. I would have liked it to be smaller because there's so much open space inside the box. I just wish it took up less space but in the end it means absolutely nothing because i won't be keeping the box and for accessories he does come with a plunger which th th there's nothing really to add here it's a plunger it does look nice and it's something they didn't need to add but they did now the only issue is that i wish they gave him alternative hands because at the current moment he has one grabby hand and one open hand i really wish he came with like two fists it's not like that they have no space in the package because they got plenty of space in there it's not something needed but something i really wish they added in now taking a look at mario this has to be one of the best Mario figures we've ever gotten. This may be better than the SH figure arts or anything Jack specific ever made. <laughs> this figure is amazing. Taking a look at the sculpt, he looks really accurate to what he looks like in the movie, which is just what he looks like in the games, but more realistic. This just looks really good. The amount of detail throughout this entire figure is insane. There's so much little sculpt details like on the hat, in the hair, and the mustache, on his shirt, on his pants, on his shoes. It just looks so good. I am honestly really impressed press but i do have one issue is that there's a molding error on the torso now it's probably just exclusive to my figure but i feel like i have to mention it it doesn't ruin it for me but it's just something that sucks now taking a look at the paint there's not a lot here before what there is it looks amazing this is like the best paint job i've ever seen for a jack specific figure there's all these little tiny paint details throughout the figure that just looks so good and the best part is definitely the eyes they're painted so well but they're a bit weird so on the packaging they mention the fact that there are realistic eyes and what they mean by that is that the eyes are actually in the head a little bit with some transparent plastic in front so it looks like mario's eyes are moving with you which is an interesting idea i think it's a neat feature but it kind of ruins taking photos of this guy because he just always is staring at you and taking a look at the articulation it is better than what i expected from a mario figure the head can move side to side if you do try you can get it all the way around but i'm not gonna risk it there is surprisingly a ball joint at the torso he can move around side to side the arms can move all the way around Round and can go out about that far there's a single bend at the elbow that can swivel side to side as well as there's a swivel at the hand the legs can move forward about that far back about that far out about that far swivel single bend at the knee and there's a ball joint at the feet and for some size comparisons here he is next to a average size action figure which is the sh figure arts buzz lightyear based off his look from lightyear i just got this figure recently so he's just sitting here which by the way amazing figure i highly recommend you get this sh figure arts buzz lightyear but as you can see he is definitely shorter than other figures. overall this has to be one of the best mario figures we've ever gotten he is so good the details are amazing the paint's amazing just everything about this figure is amazing i highly recommend you get this figure as well as luigi i'm not sure about toad or peach because i don't have them if you're gonna get mario you gotta get luigi i found mine at gamestop i highly recommend you get this figure